Okay, Sam, ready. I'm recording right now. No, Sam was. Interference is right. Alright, you guys, we're going to be on here in a second, so 
Just so you know, whenever you say it'll probably be heard. Yes, sir. Can, I don't care what you say. But what's it? What's it on? Lax? Lax TV. I'll tweet it out in a minute. Once I'm for, uh, even in San Diego. I'll tag you guys in the tweet. Okay. So I'll make sure I have it uh, right huh? up and running. <laughs> All right, folks, we're here live in Berkeley, California. We have the California Bears versus University of San Diego, San Diego Toreros. Uh, we are a little bit late. It's 13-18 left in the second quarter with the Bears leading 2-1. to one. Uh, San Diego just went man down. And this is my first time ever doing play-by-play, -play, so bear with me. <laughs> California goal number nine. Goal number nine, John Hoffinger. John Hoffinger. Cal comes into this game with a four and two record. They started off the season with losses, a loss to Oregon, 13 to eight, and they also lost to Cal Poly, 10 to eight, but have wins over Oregon State, Utah, Arizona, and Texas a and uh, San Diego comes into this game. They are one and two. Uh, overtime win over UCLA, five to four. Uh, you can see that game on the Lacrosse Network. And they had a loss five to four to Arizona State and eight seven loss to Cal State. Four. Who uh, Cal wins the faceoff, bringing the ball down the wing. Ball gets to the attack. San Diego looks to double. Number nine Hoffinger maintains possession. Cal's going to go through the subs. Cal has, uh, has some new coaches joining them this year. They uh, Former assistant coach Pete Langhammer stepped aside, and uh, two new assistants have joined uh, coach Dan Norris, who's been at Cal for quite some time. I don't know the exact number of years. Cal's operating out of a 22 formation, looking to dodge from X here in a little two-man game. Ball's worked up top to number 10, Tano Cohen. He has two goals already on the day. I'm losing to a 2 3 1. This is a set they use a lot. They usually look to feed the crease or let number two work from that left wing. He's pretty dangerous. San Diego's running a man to man, which is uh, something we haven't seen from them a lot. They usually run the zone. Maybe looking to change things up here. Number 23, Robert Hoffinger dodges, looks back across the cage. Cal being really patient uh, against the San Diego defense that's playing really tight in on the backside. Cal working the two-man game from behind here. <laughs> Looks like uh, out of a deuces set. You know, with a one-on-one. -on -one. That is number 14, Sean Hayden on the shot. Cal comes right back to work with number uh, two, Connor Thomas. Working that left wing. Good defense by the Terrarios right there. Cal being patient, using a lot of different sets. They've run a 22, uh, a 2 3 1, now they're going to go into a 1 4. Uh, they're really looking to attack this to our defense. Number 2, Connor Thomas, an outside shot. Nice save by the goalie. Uh, the goalie for San Diego, Derek. I cannot say that last name. Skazo Fava. Skazo Fava. I'm getting some help here from the San Diego fans. He's been quite a good goalie for the Toreros this year. He was really stellar in their game against UCLA, which was a overtime win for the, the Toreros. San Diego is able to clear a little bit cluttered, but they're able to get the ball through. Number eight has it. Daniel Brehan, and he settles it up. San Diego is known to run a nice, slow, patient offense and defense. 
so we should see probably a nice long progression here. Sinio being patient, sitting up on a 1 4. Dodge comes up from up top here. Foul doubles. Nothing. Oh, and number 23, Zane Kohler with the shot and the goal. Right over the stick of uh, Cal Goley, Casey Keenan. Bears with 9.24 left in the second quarter. Folks, if you have some feedback for us, and we can reach on Twitter at LaxTV. That's L-A-X-X-TV. Apologize for the worst try. Uh, some people are asking if the camera is really shaky. Uh, you're looking at the Ole Miss UT game. Uh, unfortunately, we're not there. We Tennessee screen the game. And they're doing the best they can. Thank you, Marcus. All right, so uh, Cal lost the face off but was able to clear. And now they have the ball on offense with number 20. They balance up and look to make their subs. Cal seems content to keep the tempo that San Diego Tempo likes to run. Number two, Connor Thomas possesses behind, works the ball around to number nine, John Hoffinger. Up to 23, Robert Hoffinger. I'm guessing those guys are brothers of some sort, but don't actually know that. Yes, they are. It's been but if they go to that one, uh, that was a big save by number four from the Toreros, and San Diego looks to clear. Matt is down there somewhere. Um, can you, why don't you wait until the quarter, okay? Can you wait for the quarter to get down there? Are you okay with that? Sorry about that. We have children with us today, so we are working both parenting, commentating, and a camera here. Uh, so San Diego was able to clear uh, some set up here in a looks to be a two-three-one of sorts, kind of a circle formation actually. No one on the crease. That was pretty slow, and they'll take that. I expect San Diego to have a nice long possession here, just get patient, uh, trying to work for their shot. They seem to like number 23, uh, Zane Kohler. He dodges down the alley, looks to the crease for number one, Peter DeSantis. Number eight with the ground ball. 12 gets the ball, settles up. Again, patience. San Diego being very patient on their offensive possessions, not trying to force anything. Senio working on a 1 4 1, keeping the ball around the outside right now. There we go, looks like we're going to go 14, uh, he's going to dodge. Look for a crease look. Like, yeah! Low to high rep from number 12 on the Toreros. Oh, number 12, San Diego. Uh, number 12 is Blake Ferraro. Excellent shot by uh, Blake. Kind of low angle, probably not the one the coach is always looking for, but he put it in the back of the net, which the coach is always happy like. We're tied at three here, 631 left in the second quarter. San Diego wins the faceoff, but number 20 from Cal comes up with the ground ball. That's the second time he's made a nice play like that. Eric Sonkinson. Timeout, Cal. Timeout, Cal. So she goes just on. She Googles Lax TV, LAXX TV. I want to watch the game. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's. Trying to connect to the stream, she said. Mom didn't come. 
Six sixteen left in the half. And Cal's being patient, holding the ball outside. San Diego looks like they're in their patented zone. And Cal has to work the ball around the outside. Cal operating out of a kind of an offset one four one. Now they get into it. Looking to try to break the zone. They're dodging from up top. Look for a wing shot. Good shot from number 10, Daniel Cohen. Uh, number three steps in and takes the shot right off the dome. Cal resets. She sees it. Yeah, she's going. 30 seconds. Is it jumpy Goal, Cal, number two, Connor Thomas. And Connor Thomas scores a goal. Uh, we were looking away trying to help some of the fans here, help the fans back home. <laughs> Another reason to have rain signs. So here we are, it's four to three, 528 left in the half. Cal's taking 20 shots, uh, San Diego's taking 11. Uh, looks like San Diego's been winning the face off, so let's see what happens here. And maybe they can come with the crown ball. At the face off X, we have number seven for Cal and number 20. I can't read the blue number. 22. 22. Seven wins it clean, comes out with a break. But Cal is content to settle it up. San Diego does a good job of getting back to the hole, not allowing them to get a fast break out of that. Connor Thomas has the ball on the wing. Cal gets their subs on. San Diego looks to be starting in a man to man. Cal operating out of a 141. 14 dodges. Going down the right alley. Looks to roll back. Skips it across to number nine. That's Robert Hoffinger. No, John Hoffinger. Excuse me. Gets the ball up to number 17. That's San, Sandy McNaughton. Works the ball around to Robert Hoffinger. Cal has a lot of movement on the crease right now. San Diego's doing a great job of uh, covering it, so it's not free to get open. Number 33 for Cloud Dodges. Looks to roll back. Passes the ball on number nine. Falls on the carpet. Ball's uh, been picked up by number two, Connor Thomas, who takes a shot, bounces a little high over the cage, and it'll be Cal's ball. Cal comes in playing a little two-man game here from behind with number nine and number 14. Good lift check by number 27. Does a nice job of denying the pass across the crease, which was open. So Cal resets. Number 14 for Cal. It's Sean Hayden. Dodges quick, quick little roll and uh, shoots right out of that roll dodge. Something the coach loves. Oh, look, San Diego forces a turnover. They'll have to clear. And San Diego's able to clear easily. We have a little break here. It's a little slight four and three. Forces a pass in the middle. Ball's in the carpet. It's a little two on two GB. It's flicked out. Picked up by the goalie, Casey Keenan. Ball's picked up by number 19 for Cal. Gets the ball up to number nine. That's John Hoffinger. John's looking to push the, push the tempo here. Makes a nice little step inside. Nice save, Shots. Good save by the goalie, Derek. Skazapana. <laughs> he did an excellent job there. I, I will probably not get his name right all night. And number 23, Zane Kohler. Gets the ball across, and San Diego touches in and settles up. Timeout by Coach Rock. San Diego starts out here. Cal looks to be in kind of a lockoff situation, trying to strip the ball from number eight. Eight's moving his feet. Thirteen from Cal as continues to attack.
He's doing a good job of keeping possession. And he's able to get the ball away. Now, now San Diego sets up in a circle offense. Looks like Cal's in the adjacent side package while they do that. Working the ball around the outside. Just being patient. They slide into a 2 3 1 set. We have 227 left in the half here. Cal, uh, it's very possible that San Diego might be waiting for a last shot here. It's a little bit early for that, but knowing their pace of play, that's sometimes what happens. They've set up in a one-on-one -on -one behind, kind of a, a one four one of sorts, a little bit high, high crease. Look for the feed off his stick. Picked up by number 23, Zane Kohler. He shoots a little away, and goalie Casey Keenan has a nice save. Cal looks to clear. We're going to be up and over pass here. We have a little four and three break with number 12 leading the break. Pass to Connor Thomas who can't handle the pass. Ball is out and will be San Diego ball. That's a tough call. Right? You, you go in and try to get it. And San Diego is clearing. And San Diego stays on side, successfully clears the ball with a minute 30 left in the half period. A relatively quiet half in terms of penalties. Only seen one so far since we've gotten here. Once again, we apologize for being a little bit late. Had some traffic delays. Come all the way down from Florida Park, California, where Beautiful. a couple of us are coaches at Sonoma State. And we have a Sonoma State player with us. Number nine's working, the, getting, getting battled by number 13 again, but maintains possession after losing the ball for a second. Under 60 seconds to go. Oh, pushing the back there, and Cal's gonna go man down. 30 second push with 51 seconds to go. San Diego's down by one. Watch, make sure you let everyone know how you got me to come. How you're, how you're paying me for the service. San Diego's man up here. They start in a 1-4-1 uh, set. Working the ball around the outside. And the ball's on the ground. Picked up by number 19 from Cal. He's heading up the field. Blue's riding him out number 12 rides, but White is very fast and he's able to out. Ball still on the ground. Looks like it's going to be blue ball. Almost a really amazing player and play across the middle of the field. Either way, they killed uh, a good 15 seconds of the penalty, so San Diego will only man up for about another 10 seconds. In fact, I believe that they have already released the penalty. San Diego may be content to just possess here and not turn it over. Nothing's done. So we go into the half. Half We're time. Cal leading four. Cal four. San Diego, San Diego three. three. We'll be right back, folks. We're gonna take a quick pause because that's what's going on. Any good? There it is. What's up, dude? Yeah, it's half time. The time of my life. USD's goalie's the boss, huh? Pauses. Let's pick it up. He said, she says it pauses a lot and then it gets stuck. Mm, might be our connection. I'll tell you. Yeah, he's going to tell you. Yeah. She says it, she says it pauses a lot and stops. Does it? Yeah. Right. This is not going to work out. This is not going to work out. Yes. So he's staying in California. We're going to go to the page in about 
So, hang on. Yeah, yeah. Alright, hold on. Reload the page in. Concessions are up the stairs. We've got coffee, rice, rice. hot soup, hot cocoa. Go out of our truck. Plenty of stuff to warm me up. Yeah. Reload the page. Well, it changed all fast. Get rid of the trouble. Okay, sure, sure. Come on, Coach. Tell me how you're done. Well, this is a hot mic here, so. It's, uh, There's uh, the first couple of games. No, it's off now. Just the huge. <laughs> <It's just like laughs> <right away. laughs> Effects for Cal, we have number seven, Evan Price, and for San Diego, we have number 10, Bailey Nygaard. Cal wins the faceoff, possesses. Thought about pushing the tempo, but didn't. Balls out with number 10, Robin Hoppinger. Hopefully, I'll say Hoppinger right. I've been corrected by the Cal fans. And number 23, possesses. San Diego looks to be in a man to man. Surprising, they ran their zone against UCLA, what I watched in that game. And here they are content to be in a man. Looking to double. Cal setting up into a 1-4-1. And uh, they're going to get into uh, one guy behind a dodge and just some motion up top. Feed to number two. Number two, Connor Thomas scores for Cal. Oh, Cal. Number two, Connor Thomas. Connor Thomas. Uh, 
has 15 goals and 6 assists on the season. He is a senior attackman for Cal. One of the premier threats in the WCLA. The face-off X, we have number 7, Evan Price for Cal again. And number 22, <laughs> Simon Menard for San Diego. Number 7 has done pretty well so far. Looks like he's winning most of the face-offs. He's able to get the ball out. It's a scrum here in the middle. Ball is still on the ground, picked up by number 14 for Cal, who looks to pass the ball to number 23. And number seven has the ball back. Correction, uh, that's number one, it looks like. Running the ball, clears it up the alley. And gets the ball down to number nine, John Hawkins. Cal settles up and gets their sub done. Cal leads 5-3, 13-34 to go in the game, or in the third quarter. Cal's dodging from Mexico, a single guy behind, looking to roll and find space. Shot by number 14, Sean uh, Hayden. Nice save by number four in goal for the San Diego Toreros. Number four is a freshman, I believe, yep. and played at Poway High School. He's uh, been lights out for San Diego this year and a really important part of their defense. Talk about the bad boys. Shot by number 14, Sean Hayden again. Connor Thomas comes around the edge, turns, shoots, hits the crossbar, backed up by Kevin. Cal continues to like the set with one guy behind or two guys behind, uh, dodging to come around for Max. Working kind of a 1 1 4. He's probably going to stay. Number 14, Halo makes a move, gets his hands free. No. And elects to pull the ball out instead. Settles back up to go for the dodge again. Feed to number nine, all wide open on the crease, hits it off the crossbar. Cal backs it up at number 10. Cal gets in their subs off the horn. And San Diego, San Diego subs, no, subs no more. Ball starts on the uh, goalie's left with number 10, Robert Hoffman. Works the ball around the outside. Cal looks to be setting up into a... They keep looking like they're going to go into deuces, but then it just goes into four guys on the crease. So not really a deuces. Either. Number 11 drives down the alley, rolls back, and shoots. Nice left check by San Diego to get the ball out of bounds. As Cal's running a little two-man game behind. With number 10. Uh, that's Daniel Cohen, actually. I've been calling him Robert Hoffinger. That's not some Daniel Cohen. <laughs> San Diego looks to clear and is able to easily. San Diego settles into a little bit of a circle offense here. Looks like they're going to be patient for a few minutes uh, after Cal has had the ball for the first four minutes of the quarter. San Diego settles. They're able, they've been able to trap the offensive middies for Cal on the defensive end. So we'll see if they're able to take advantage of this. San Diego sets up on a 1-4-1. One, one. With number 14 looking to dodge. Beats his man number 33. No slide. And 14 throws the ball over, over the attackman's head. Cal looks to push. And Cal's able to clear. One pass to number 23. San Diego stays in their man to man. Cal sits up in uh, makeshift 2-3-1 here. 
Dodge down the alley by number 11. Spins the ball backside to number 14. Or number 29, really. That's packed. Good lift check to force a shot over the goal. Ball starts with number 10, Daniel Cohen from X. Pick comes from number 23. Inside roll is not there. Nice lift check by number 27. He's playing good, solid, fundamental position defense. Number 11 is dodging up top. Nice lift check by 20. 37, rather. Ball was able to get out, picked up by Cal. Ball moved across and reset. Cal settles up, makes a couple subs. Looks like they're bringing the uh, bring on that next midfield unit. Number 27 carries, looks to go inside, rolls back. Shoots low to high over the cage. Back up. Right Do it again, Sam. <laughs> Cal running from behind. A little two man game here. Number nine has a ball on the right wing, looking to try to get to Shooter's Island. Comes around the cage, and correction by number nine, number two, Connor Thomas. He takes a shot, good save by the goal. Back up. Again, folks, if you want to interact, give any feedback, let us know how the game's going, what does it look like, you can tweet us at at LaxTV, L-A-X-X TV. Ask a trivia question. We have no trivia questions despite the question in the gallery for trivia. Cal sets up in a circle offense. Looks like they're going to be a little patient, get the ball around. Maybe try to spread out this Torero's defense, which has stayed really nice and compact so far. Number 23 dodges down the eye, feeds down to number 10, Daniel Cohen, who's got two goals. And he shoots wide of the cage, backed up by Cal. Cal's had the ball for a majority of this half so, or this quarter so far. They're closing in on eight and a half minutes left from the quarter, and I would have to guess that Cal's had the ball for at least six or seven of that. Nice little two-man game. Yeah. Connor Thomas is able to put that away on a low-angle shot. Shot over the goalie's shoulder. Nice little two-man game. The pass came from uh, number 23. Goal, Cal. Number two, Connor Thomas. From Robert Hoffinger. Assist by number 27, Sam Schlomer. Uh, correction. Number 27, Sam, Sam Schlomer. <laughs> Josh, 6-3 with 825 left in the third quarter. Okay, we have number seven of the face-up X for uh, Cal. Looks like he went early. And number 32 for the Toreros is up, and he's got the ball. And Cal is able to, or San Diego gets the ball in the offensive line. San Diego sets up in a little circle offense. Probably looking to give their defense a couple of minutes of break here and see what they can see if they can attack out of this Cal, Cal Bears defense. Goalie, K, Goalie Casey Keenan has only seen 13 shots so far today. So San Diego certainly is probably going to try to get a few more of those. Meanwhile, Cal has shot 34 times with his six goals. San Diego has been working on this 1 4 1 set a lot. Now, number eight, the Dodger this time. And nothing doing. Pins! Oh. Oh, excuse me. San Diego's able to get the ground ball, and they're looking to work for a dodge here. Looks like San Diego's trying to be smart, not force too many passes. Ball's back up top of number 12. Okay. Okay. And it looks like San Diego's going to come with a little high wing type dodge. Going down the side. Good defense by number one. Pushes them out. Ball 
Falls up top of number 23, Zane Kohler, who has a goal on the evening. Zane's got some nice feet. Nice job getting open for that shot the first time. Looks like they'll probably try to come back to him here, maybe out of this 1 4 1 set again. Nope, they're gonna go from number 8. Dodge from X. Coming around the corner looking for the feed. Number 12's open, but doesn't have it. Looks to push the backside. Nothing's there. Feed in the middle. Number. Goal like San Diego, goal. number 1. For San Diego, Peter DeSantis. He was wide open on the crease of that. Uh, dodge from behind by number 32. <laughs> How's it going? Yeah, okay. Place on the committee? Well, all the time. She's alive. She like you. I'll do my class. And a legal procedure on white, blue ball. That's two in a row on Evan Price. You know, he's he was winning all the faceoffs early, so curious to see if he'll uh, take a step back here and, and try to slow down or if that's going to affect him kind of going late into this game. It looks like it's going to be close, so faceoff sorting going to be a key. So he sets up in a circle offense, just working the ball around the outside, being patient. around the league, it looks like Santa Clara and Minnesota, Santa Clara, another WCR team, is tied with Minnesota. Uh, Minnesota's going to face off against Cal tomorrow, and they'll see San Diego on Tuesday, I believe. Uh, nice check by the Cal defender. Falls up in the air, picked up by goalie Casey Keenan. He looks upfield, but it's dropped. And number 23, Zane Kohler from San Diego comes up with the ball. Feed to number one, shot, and... Ball is backed up by number eight from San Diego. Number eight is Daniel Brehan. San Diego sets up in, looks like it's gonna be a 2-2-2, but hard to tell, they're not really kind of clear. Number one's working pretty hard on the crease right now, trying to get open, trying to see if there's another weakness there. Beats his man to oh, the side, Diego, and Blake 12. Ferraro has another goal in the evening. Also, that's 6-5 to five with 4.58 left in the third quarter, and San Diego scored two on answer. So we have Evan Price at the faceoff X for Cal, and for San Diego we have number 22, Simon Menard. For seven day we get the ball out quick and fix it up for possession. It's the ball down to number 14, Sean Hayden. Sean Hayden sells the ball up. Number three in pursuit. Number three is Eric. Uh, no, correction that is Kyle goes off. Obviously, the brother of the goalie, whose name I still can't pronounce. Cal sets up in a. Looks like some umbrella set with uh, one behind and one on the crease. Looking to feed, feeds up top to number 10. Number 10 shoots, and this is wide left. A little two man game from Cal from behind. Coming around is number 14, nothing there. Works the ball around. Uh, Our first is number 27. Dodge comes from up top here from number 23. Works the ball down to Connor Thomas, who tries to be his man inside for the shot. Ooh. And he does. And no crease violation there. Connor oh, Thomas scores. Number two, Connor Thomas. Second goal roll for Connor Thomas. So let's get some scores from around the league. Looks like Chapman is up 7 to 5. <laughs> Let's see who they're playing here. Kevin's up 7 to 5 on Colorado. We also have uh, Santa Clara tied with Minnesota in the third quarter. 6, 30, six minutes and 30 seconds left. <laughs> Grove City in Division 2 from CCLA beat Taylor 12 to 2 earlier today. Uh, Cal wins the faceoff, and here we go, another Cal possession. 7-5, 348 left in the third quarter. 
Right. Well, and number 14, Sean Hayden works his man. Pulls out his patient. Looks like Cows and Subtle up here getting their offense. Doing their sets. <laughs> Cal's set up in a, in what really appears to be kind of a 1-5, a no one behind, just working. Now they reset into kind of an offset, uh, decent set. Number two, Connor Thomas takes a shot. Nice save by Derek. This goes Flava. And Sandy, a ball on the carpet, comes up with uh, Cal Bears, number nine, John Hoffman. Passes down to number 10, Dana Cohen. And smart decision, pulls the ball out, set all things up. Nothing there. Sending a nice job getting back on defense. <laughs> number 11 shoots. Nice save by the goalie, Derek Scapata. And Sandy okay. looks at the Oh my gosh, they have 27 inches in 24 hours. And 27 is able to clear, no problem. Gets the ball to number 8. Number 8 gets the ball in and touches. San Diego is able to successfully clear and settles up the offense. 2.18 left in the quarter here. Cal leads 7 to 5. San Diego keeps working the ball around, being patient. Looks like they're going to try to find their matchup and get the dodge that they want. New assistant coach Ed Hill for Cal, barking out some orders to the defense. And it looks like Zane Cole is going to get the dodge here again. He's done pretty well tonight. Breaks down the alley, and there's a whistle. Interference on San Diego. Ball's going back to Cal. One forty-six left in the quarter. Cal's looking to clear. San Diego looks to be playing in a man-to-man -man ride, except for uh, except for the two attacking zone uh, attacking. And Cal clears successfully. Has a nine man break here. Looks like they're going to try to push his pace. Come around. A little tic tac toe. Ball goes from number 14. Oh, Sean Hayden to number nine. John Hoffinger for the goal. Cal scores 8 to 5 with 119 left in the third quarter. <coughs> Cal's really known for those types of clears. You know, there's a really nice patience. They look to try to catch you in an offside situation. And if you don't, a lot of times they get a little bit of a odd break there. And they run a nice little uh, right down the alley, pass it around, and got the guy coming around from X. Here we go, 22, Simon Menard against number seven, Evan Price. White ball here. And with 112 left, looks like Cal's a little hat, hole for the last shot they want to. Getting all the subs in. Cal works the ball back across to Connor Thomas. And it looks like they're going to be patient here. He was hard to pack. Connor Thomas being guarded by number 31 from San Diego. Pass to number 14, and he likes not to shoot. Ball's behind number 22, it looks like. We're in a little two-man game here. Nice little switch off, 27. Now Connor Thomas has the short stick. This is a matchup that Cows and Lions play. There's 20 seconds left in the period. Connor Thomas comes around, shoots outside. Goalie's got about 15 seconds left. And San Diego's looking to clear here. They're patient, not looking to push too much here. Just trying to look to clear and maybe make a smart pass. Not rushing. Two seconds left, one shot, and that's the end of the quarter. With Cal 8. End of the third quarter. San Diego 5. Cal You're watching San Diego 5. Still plenty of hot cocoa, hot TV. coffee, and hot soup. We'll be right back. Here in concessions. Is, I'm so bad at this. 
Not bad. I'm actually finding myself listening to you while I'm watching the game. Oh, really? Oh, sorry. That's pretty funny. I did, they're, they don't get in sets very quickly. It's pretty hard to tell. Like, he sent me his, like, what are they in? Hello. Good job. <laughs> Yeah. It's eight like to five over the Toreros. Uh, it's been a back and forth game. Cal really came out in that third quarter and did a really nice job getting some uh, contested ground balls. Had possession for the first seven minutes and attacked in transition, which is certainly one of their strengths and probably one of the areas that San Diego likes to avoid. So here we go in the final 15 minutes. Uh, number seven, Evan Price, is going to face off at 22, Simon Menard. Bam. This has been a, an area where Evan Price has dominated so far this game. And he wins the faceoff again. But he is unable to hold the ball. And it's illegal procedure, but we have another whistle. Looks like it's going to be a discussion. <coughs> Unclear if there's a possession call or not. And we have a reface. <laughs> now. <laughs> I don't know who I'm being mean, told that one ref called possession, and therefore it's a, essentially an inadvertent whistle, but since no one had possession of the ball, it can go AP. But when you have a faceoff that no possession is decided, I think it just goes back to a reface. Well, obviously it goes back to a reface. So here we go, we have another faceoff battle. <laughs> And here we go, the ball is out. It's on the carpet. Looks like Lou kicks it. And keeps it in play, number 15 does. Play on! Ball's still down. Ball push! Push back, Lou! Go to White! White ball and loose ball push. And Cal looks to clear. And they're able to do so. And Cal's going to settle up and get into their, their settled offense. Now, we did have some San Diego fans up here with us earlier, but I think they have since migrated to a different area, and now we're surrounded by Cal fans. Some scores from around the MCLA, watching the Twitter feed. Looks like it's 3-2 Santa Clara, uh, leading the Minnesota Golden Gophers at the end of the third quarter. Not exactly uh, the goal-scoring machine that uh, Santa Barbara and Chico game was. Here we go. San Diego makes a nice save, gets the ball down the on the clear and gets it down the alley. Settles the ball up at X. Looks like they're gonna get in their so they're getting their subs, being patient, not gonna force the ball in transition. This is San Diego's game. They have done very well in their set offenses. They created, created some good looks uh, and, and done a nice job with that. It makes sense for them to stay that way. I think every time they time where it's only 1330 to go, they're going to start to press a little bit since they're down three goals. Setting up in a circle, they slide into that 1-4-1 one one set that they like so much. Number eight's gonna dodge from up top on number 19. Eight dodges and shoots. Wide left, backed up by number 23, Zane Kohler. Zane draws the pull, comes around the uh, X, rolls back. Looks like he's got his man beat. Ball is out, but number 14 is there to scoop it up. San Diego resets. Looks like number 32 is going to get the dodge from up top here. And here we go, number 32 goes. He's got his man beat. Slide comes, shot, and it's going to come out blue ball. Good hustle by the goalie, Casey Keenan, but it's blue ball. San Diego dodges from X here. Number 14 coming around the, coming around. He's number 12, who steps inside, shoots on the run and scores. That's number 12, Blake oh, Ferraro. Number 12. I believe that is his third goal of the night. Eight to six at 12.29 to go. Just 19 shots for San Diego this, this game so far. They've just been very selective with what they're shooting at and has generated goals on about 30%. Bears. 
Just seeing the Twitter feed over here, it looks like Chapman is leading Colorado 7-6. White wins the faceoff again on an illegal procedure. And they run a fast break. Tic-tac-toe. Shot is wide by Daniel Cohen. Back up goes to Cal Bears. Timber is starting to drop here in Berkeley. This is what happens in California at night. It gets, the sun goes down and there's no humidity in the air and it seems to drop off to what us Californians call freezing. It's really just 50 degrees. <laughs> Cal working another two, another two minute game, but there's a moving pick call on Cal, and San Diego will have an opportunity to clear. Cal's doing a little jump ride here, but they are unable to uh, successfully get the ball on the ground, and San Diego looks to clear right here, and it looks like they will be able to. San Diego settles up in their subtle offense, starting in the circle. Working the ball around the outside. Again, folks, if you want to ask us any questions, get a feeling of what's going on, hit us up on Twitter, Lax TV, L A X X TV. If you don't follow us yet on uh, on Twitter, give us a follow now, and go to our Facebook page. You can like us there. We want to get up to 500 likes before the end of the night. Here we go. San Diego's going to dodge out of their one for one set. Number eight's got the ball. Dodges down the left-hand alley. Nothing there. It works the ball around to X. Feed into the side to number one. He gets a shot off. Great save by Casey Keenan. Way to stand tall on the cage. Does a nice job, and that ball's out. Backed up by San Diego. I hear uh, the goalie's sister is near us and listening to our broadcast. Casey is a junior, I believe. For, he's a senior. He's a senior for the Cal Bears. He has been a stalwart goalie for some time now and done a great job in the in the for the Bears. Uh, I know I coached Snowman last year. He did an excellent job of keeping us out of the back of the net, allowing only seven goals. San Diego loses the ball momentarily, was able to get it back. And they're settling up in their offense here. Looks like number one is working really hard on the crease and trying to create some seams. Uh, it's, he's got a couple of goals tonight, and so it, it's definitely going to be important for Cal to keep, keep an eye on him. Here we are, the 1 4 1 again. Number eight's going to dodge. Eight seems to like his left hand, and he comes down the left hand alley, shoots. It's wide right, backed up by San Diego. Daniel comes uh, with the ball, gets it up to number 12. Number 12 is going up top. Gets the ball to number 8. Number 8 goes up top again. Back over to Zane. Kohler, number 23. He comes down this uh, wing. Swim dodge. Nothing there. Doesn't like what he gets. Number 8 comes down that left hand alley. Doesn't shoot. Looks to roll back. Nothing there. San Diego resets. Looks like they're coming down this uh, wing dodge again with Zane. He likes not to dodge, just a little dummy move. Number 14 carries the ball over the top. Looks like he's going to dodge. A little sweet move here. Looking up. Nice little defense and throws the ball away. A nice check by number 13. Good possession from San Diego, but we were not able to get a goal out of that. Uh, the one really good shot they had was stopped by the goalie, Casey King. Cal looks to clear here. All their subs come on, and one sub comes free. Cal's got numbers here. It's a little four and three break. Able to work it down the near side. Shot and goal by number 10, Daniel Cohen, off the pass from number 14, Sean Hayden. Goal, Cal, number 10, Daniel Cohen. Colorado, 8 to 7. Let's go, Bears. Let's go, Evan. Right here, it's the fourth quarter, 9 3 left. Cal leads 9 to 6 over the Toreros of San Diego. 
And number seven is again able to win the faceoff. He has been dominant at the X. And it's a uh, cow ball. Looks like some. No, I never do this a lot. What's going on here? But no release on that, and so Cal's able to clear easily. And Cal sets up. Looks like they're going to get a 42 offense. San Diego looks to be in their man to man still. Haven't seen a lot of zone from Contreras tonight. This is odd. They, they really love their zones, and you know, it must be that they see something that they like in their matchups or, or something with that uh, that they've elected to stay in this man to man defense. Cal continue to be patient, working. Looks like they're going to work a little two man game behind here. Looks like both the two men clear out, and now it's just a one on one. Number 20 playing some good defense for San Diego. It's being physical. Now they're back to the two man. Now they have the matchup that they like. They have Connor Thomas on a shorty. Number 20 is on a good job with his feet. Let's see what happens here. Let's him get top side. Shot over the goal. Backed up by Cal. Cal rolls the ball up to number 23. And they set up here. Looks like a dodge coming. Dodge 23 down the right-hand alley. He's got space. He shoots and scores. Blown away shot. Ball, Cal, number 23, Robert Hoffinger. Robert Hoffinger scores a goal. Put Cal up 10 to 6 with 7.26 to go. According to the Cal scoreboard, there's been 45 shots taken by Cal today compared to just 21 for San Diego. Back to the face-off X we go. We have number seven, Evan Price for Cal, and number 32, Austin Pavin for San Diego. Mr. Price has been all of the Toreros can handle out that X. And it looks like, uh, looks like it's a 50-50 ball here. Ball's in the box. Cal comes up with the ball, and they're looking to clear. They are able to clear the ball. It's cow ball, being patient. They're yellow so that they can get their subs on. You know, for those of you new to lacrosse, yellow is pretty much a standard call for substitutions. And San Diego is starting to press out a little bit, recognizing that with uh, only 6.45 to go, they're going to need to get some turnovers. Get that ball back down on offense if they want to get, get back in this game. Cal continues to run their offense, and Connor Thomas looks for an inside roll. Not there. Swings the ball through. Oh, nice play by number 27 on the Toreros. Uh, unable to handle the ball, but knocked it down and definitely did not have a scoring opportunity for the Bears. Here we go. Number 11 comes dodging. Looking to go down the right hand alley. Looks on a little sweep. Turns the corner, shoots. Saved by goalie Derek Scasfava. He has been lights out, although he just makes a clearing pass set. Not sure why he made that pass. Seems like it was a covered man, but not the case apparently. Balls, balls down the carpet, number 27, trying to pick it up. Can't, can't handle it. Number 10 has it for Cal. Ball comes back out. It's back out with number 9. Number 10's in the crease, so it's San Diego ball. <laughs> kind of an interesting uh, little 15 seconds there. Number four, the goalie, Derek, for San Diego has been really good between the pipes, and his clearing has been excellent. Uh, it was kind of an interesting decision to make that pass. San Diego looks to clear, makes a little dump pass to number 24. He's open. And balls up in number eight. Number eight is definitely one of San Diego's favorite Dodgers. And with 5.30 to go, San Diego's got to score three goals. So here we go. 
Coach Robbie Warner talking to his guys. Slow pick by Zane Kohler. Feeds the ball. Gets it through. And looking to come around. Nothing there. Number 23, Zane Kohler's got the ball up top. Steps inside. Shoots. Wide of the cage right. Backed up by San Diego. Ball's going to start at number 12. He's got a couple goals in the night. Let's see what he's going to do with the ball. Looks like they're going to run a little two-man game here. 12 gets around. Feeds it across. Picked off by number 19 for Cal. 18 for Cal. Who jumps up to number 29. He's got some numbers here. Four and three break. Pass across. Shot. Nice save and a goalie. Wow. Excellent save by Derek. He's got the ball. He's gets it out. And here we go. San Diego's coming the other way. Transition scoring opportunity doesn't look like it's going to be there as Cal has all their guys back. 432 left in the game, folks. You're watching that Men's Collegial Lacrosse Association on LAX TV. We're here in beautiful Berkeley, California at the Cal uh, Maxwell Family Field. Cal leads 10 to 6. In the game. Pass. Pass number one. Who shoots. Nice save by goalie Casey Keenan. And now they're looking to clear. They try to make the up and over pass, and they successfully complete it. I would say Brooke was more nostalgic. And number 29, dodges right through the defense. Shoots and scores. 29 goes right through the heart of the defense. Scores the goal. Goal is 11-6 with, with 3.53 to go. He's going to face against number 22, Simon Menard. Let's see what happens. Again, Price is able to get it out, but uh, Cal's unable to get the handle. Ball's on the counter. Big hit by San Diego, and they're able to get the ball up. Now they're pushing a little bit in numbers, and number 12 throws the ball away. The ball is down again. If San Diego picks it up, they're going to have a get it in, keep it in call. And it looks like there is a loose ball push on blue. Here Coach Warner saying push out because San Diego needs to get the ball on the carpet. 3.20 to go. Cal leads 11 to 6. Say hi to her for us. Dodge right number 27. Works the ball back to number 14, Sean Hayden. Cal seems content to just possess the ball behind right now. Not trying too hard to go to the back. And now we have three minutes to go. Oh, Sean Hayden makes a pass up top. And Cal, and Cal turns over. San Diego's at the ball, and they have some numbers. They're able to get Connor Thomas down on the defensive half of the field. So that means there's an opportunity for them right here. San Diego's number 12. Blake Ferrar dodges, shoots, backs up his own shot. Zane Kohler going to the rack. He goes, and the ball is down. Picked up, flagged down. Not sure if it's going to be a slash or a push in the back. It's a slash. One minute slashing for number 18, I believe. So Cal's man down. There's 2.31 left. 11 to 6 count. And this might be able to ignite the, the run that San Diego needs. It's going to be tough. 231 with five goals is hard to do, but it's possible. San Diego looks like they're running a little play, a little fake flip. Move the ball through. Looks like a little wheel. Shot. Saved by the goal in case you can. They're working the ball. Keeps working it. Looks like they're looking for a little wheel action here. And just be impatient. They, they don't have time to be impatient. 205 left. They need to push to the rack. Just a little skip pass number eight. Shoots saved by number 15. Uh, number 12 has the ball. Trying to be patient on the clear. They keep working the clear. Number eight's running hard. San Diego is trying to turn that ball over. The Cal is able to get the ball across and get the clear. 
And Cal's gonna get a touch here. There's some danger of a failure to advance. Oh, offsides on Cal. Ball goes to San Diego. So with 90 ticks left. San Diego ball, 11 to 6, Cal. Ball's down. And ball goes back to San Diego. Number 35 has the ball, looks like. No, ball's, ball's down the middle. Cal has it again, 23. San Diego has the ball here. We have just over a minute left. Number 14 takes it down the alley. At this point, San Diego looks like they're just going to try to put one more on the board. Here we go. Number 23 is going to dodge. Lex not to use the pick. Makes a pass. Good stick by Cal. Balls on the carpet again. And here we go. Cal picks it up. They have numbers. They have a four and three break. Are they going to take the break or are they going to hold the ball? Looks like they're going to go. Number 13 has got the ball in the box and he shoots. Off of a San Diego player, it looks like. And now they're going to, Cal's going to run their two minute drill kill. He's possessing the ball behind. San Diego sends a double. And Cal's got the ball, and here we go. It's uh, still Cal ball. <coughs> And we have a call. I'm not sure what it looks like. Timeout. Timeout for Sandy uh, for Cal. With 19 seconds left. Not sure why they call a timeout. Looked like they had clear uh, possession. No need to call a timeout. But apparently, Coach Norris felt otherwise. So, folks, with 19 seconds left, looks like Cal's gonna wrap this game up to win. Uh, probably an 11-6 score. Looking across, it's uh, two minutes left in the game at Santa Clara Golden Gophers. Uh, Santa Clara Broncos, excuse me, versus Minnesota Golden Gophers. Score is tied at four. Four to four. We have a barn burner over there. I'm pretty sure that all those fans are loving that. I'm guessing it's just going to become some stellar goat hunting. You know, goalie uh, Jake Bartz for the Santa Clara Broncos is very, very good uh, goalie. We got to see him last week. And I know that the goalie for the Gophers uh, did a nice job of, of holding his own against the uh, against the Minnesota Blue Bulldogs. So we'll see what happens there. It looks like Chapman and Colorado are playing. I don't have a score yet, but let me go look and see if I can find it. Come on, I'll put you back in the man. Uh, it looks like it looks like BYU beat New Mexico 27 to two. All right, so here we are. We're back live. You're watching California uh, Bears versus University of San Diego Toreros. Cal leads by five. Twelve seconds left in the game. Looks like they're going to be able to run this one out. She's mean. You shouldn't. Six seconds left. And folks, that's final. Cal wins 11 to six over San Diego. Cal 11. We're going to sign off in here in a second. Good night, everyone, and thank you for coming. The Toreros, uh, you know, played hard and certainly hung with them for Tomorrow quite night, a little bit. Cal Bears but it looks like Cal Minnesota was just a little bit faster here and a nice job of moving and transitioning. Hope to see you there. That third quarter was the difference maker for the Bears in their victory. Uh, again, thank you for joining us on LAX TV. Follow us on Twitter at LAX. TV, L A X X TV, and on Facebook, Facebook.com Facebook backslash LAX TV. We're going to be here all year.